Hi there, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to very easily modify the remote control, the Sima 2.4 GHz remote control for the um, Sima X5C quadcopter. This is um, a simple modification that will give you a lot better range um, with your quadcopter and the remote control. So uh, first things first, you want to remove the screws on the back here, put them all in a little cup like I've done so you don't lose them and then we're going to just lift off the back there so if you have a look it's like that and you will see when you take the shell off that it is actually a fake antenna moulded into the shell it's just for show so see that's what it is and it's just empty so what we want to do th this wire here which is um, actually the antenna was pushed down at the back there so not going to be much range there so I've stripped the top plastic, you have to be careful as it is attached to the board there, but I've stripped the main plastic up to there in this wire and stripped it down off. And um, what I've done is I've got a, another wire, what you want to do is get another wire of equal length and attach it to this one. So um, it needs to be of equal length to the one underneath because it's 2.4 gigahertz. Having a bigger antenna doesn't make it better if it's not matched to the frequency. So um, what we're going to do is go ahead and solder this to that antenna which will then in turn slide into this like so and now this antenna, the, the original fake antenna that came with it will actually be an active antenna for the Sima quadcopter. So that's how you do it, it's very easy and um, you will notice a considerable um, improvement in your range between your remote control and the quadcopter. So um, you can see that's been stripped there, the plastic from the top of the wire has been stripped there and we're just going to, see this will measure up to just pretty much double the size of what it was so just going to uh, uh, and I'm just going to solder this on. Right, so I'll um, I'll use the help of my partner while we do this, as she's holding the camera at the moment. We'll get this soldered on, and um, you'll see it'll all go back together, and it will look just like this. This one's already had the modification done to it, and um, as you can see, there's no difference to the remote control. Now, if you want to, you can get yourself um, another 2.4 gigahertz extender antenna and increase it by adding something like that, which will fit in nicely into there and connecting it to the uh, internal antenna there but uh, I do strongly suggest you do this mod and it's uh, basically the antenna that comes with it isn't very good it's um, you know pushed down and it's there inside the plastic board which is why it has such a limited range you um, you get another uh, bit of wire just the same as the antenna in there double the size of that which will then feed into this dummy antenna which will become a proper antenna and you'll notice the, um, the range increase so uh, very easy mod to do takes um, not long at all all you need is a soldering iron screwdriver and a pair of scissors maybe to strip the wire or wire strippers and um, that's about it so hope this helps you and um, happy flying